Making a PowerPoint presentation isn't hard. I'm going to take my cursor, place it on top of the PowerPoint icon, and double click to open. PowerPoint automatically opens to give me some choices. I'm going to choose the simplest option, which is a blank presentation. I'll put my cursor on blank presentation and click to open. PowerPoint automatically gives me a title slide. We know that a title tells our audience what the presentation is going to be about. So I'm going to click to add a title. Now a subtitle gives more information. I'll click in the bottom box to add a subtitle. So there I have my first slide, my title slide. I'm going to need more than one slide, so I'll move my cursor to the top next to New Slide. I will point at the arrow and click, and PowerPoint gives me some choices of types of slides. I think the title and content slide is the one I want. I'll put my cursor on the title and content slide and click. It has two boxes. I'm going to click to add a title to the top box. Now my presentation is going to be about my favorite vacation, a trip to the National Park. In the bottom box, I can either add words or I can add other things. I want to add a picture, so I'm going to put my cursor on top of the picture icon and click to open it. This opens up my files. I have my pictures on my flash drive. I'm going to open my flash drive. And in my flash drive, I have a folder with pictures. I'm going to point to my picture folder and open that up. Inside my picture folder, I have a folder with pictures I've already chosen for my presentation. So I'm going to open up that folder, point to the picture I want, and click on it. It's been now automatically added to my slide. Now that's a picture of my son in front of my car in Yellowstone National Park. I'm not going to type that, however, because that's something I will say to my audience. I need more than two slides, so to add another slide, I'll move my cursor to the top, click on the Home tab, move next to the New Slide option, and click on the arrow, move to Title and Content, click to open. I'll click in the top box to add a title. I'll click in the bottom box to add another picture. I'll put my cursor on top of the picture icon and click. This time PowerPoint automatically opens up the picture folder I want. I'll move my cursor to the picture that I want and open it up by clicking. There, PowerPoint has added my next picture. Now I can just repeat that process for as many slides as I want. But now I want to save my presentation so I don't lose it. I'll move my cursor over to the File tab. I'll click on File. I'm going to sit, click on Save As. And my I want to save my presentation to my flash drive. So I'll open up Computer, go to my flash drive, Open up my flash drive. I have a folder already named for my class presentation, so I'm going to open up my class presentation folder. And PowerPoint has used the first couple of words that I typed as the file name for this presentation, and I think it's a good file, file name, so I'm going to keep that. So I'll click on Save. And there, I've now made my first PowerPoint presentation.